hello students in this lecture we'll see important points to solve coefficient of correlation as well as a regression line so first one is first point is uh, we know that r is equal to summation x capital x into capital y divided by square root of summation of capital x square into square root of summation capital y square so this formula this formula will use when x bar and y bar are integers are integers okay this point you have to remember that is special i can say that so x bar and y bar should not be in terms of what your decimal it's supposed to be whole number so second point if that is there then we'll use this formula if suppose x bar and y bar will become what here in decimals if it is coming decimal that is x bar is nothing but summation x upon small n so if the, it is become whole number or integer i can say we'll use this formula if not we'll use the second formula that is r is equal to standard deviation that is variance square of variance of y or standard deviation square of x standard deviation of y of square minus standard deviation of z square divided by 2 times standard deviation of x standard deviation of y and this z is nothing but what here x minus y also okay this where I will mention here where z is nothing but x minus y so this formula okay this formula will use when, when here so this formula will be used when x bar and y bar are in decimal fine next third point in this third point we will see the first one here this is very important to find lines of regression to find lines of regression and then coefficient of correlation then we'll use we'll use very important first if they ask find the line of regression then coefficient of correlation then we'll use the formula capital Y is equal to summation capital XY divided by summation of capital X square into capital X this is a line of regression y on x and capital X is equal to summation xy divided by summation of capital Y square into capital Y this is x on y and with the help of this we have the formula we have the formula or you can use alternate formula for this that is y minus y bar is equal to r into standard deviation of y divided by standard deviation of x into x minus x bar and similarly this is nothing but x minus x bar so I will write it better so this is also another y minus y bar is equal to r into ok so better uh, will not go for this so use this so then coefficient r is nothing but plus or minus square root of coefficient of x into coefficient of y we'll use this formula and next point in this point number two to find 
कोफिशियंट ऑफ को रिलेशन एंड फर्स्ट कोफिशियंट ऑफ को रिलेशन एंड देन लाइन ऑफ रिग्रेशन we use we use we use formula 1 or 2 1 or 2 and and respected regression line formula so what is one in the note number one uh, what important point i have given that formula one or formula two if formula one you know what is the regression line y on x and x on y and what is for formula two what is y on x and x on y so that formula we are going to use uh, in general if you don't know anything you can use uh, a formula number uh, to fix uh, for all the examples and you will get but uh, formula two if you want to use so it will go a little bit lengthy Uh, but uh, result will be get same only here so these are the few important points while finding uh, coefficient of correlation and regression of line let's see the examples based on this uh, coefficient of correlation and regression of line so i wanted to add one more point here that point is point number 4 always r will be greater than equal to minus 1 and less than or equal to plus 1 so and you see that always r value will be less than or equal to plus or minus 1 only so you will not get answer r is equal to 6 7 2 3 no it will be always in the form of 0.9 or less than 0.9 only so you see that if r is getting more than 1 then your calculation is wrong so this point you have to remember that so r is less than, less than or equal to minus 1 and greater than or equal to what here sorry greater than or equal to minus 1 and less than or equal to plus 1 so it will be in between as, as in between what here minus 1 to plus 1 only or that to be a less than so it will never cross 1 point something or 2 point 3 point or 50 60 it will you will not get r so r will be less than what here minus 1 and uh, less than or equal to minus 1 and greater than or equal to plus 1 you have to be careful for this